it was off to Norway in the next leg of the UEFA Champions League qualifiers as James Forrest's late strike was enough to see the Celts through. Now a Celtic Park tradition, Flag Day opened up the Scottish Premiership season. Scott Brown was selected to fly the flag after 10 years at the club. To McGregor. It's in the back of the net! Kieran Tierney captained the club of his childhood for the first time competitively as Celtic got their League Cup defence underway. He even managed to get on the score sheet. Oh, what a goal! The captain scored! Oh, wonderful strike from Kieran Tierney! Astana came to Celtic Park a year on from their previous visit in the Champions League qualifiers. What a night in paradise it was. Can it be two? It's in the back of the net! Wonderful finish, Scott Sinclair! It's wonderful! It's magical! It's beautiful! It's 10 -0. Well, wonderful play from James Morris! Celtic, a masterclass in Europe. 5-0, they are beating FC Astana. With a 5-0 lead, the boys then jetted off to Kazakhstan to hopefully secure a place in the Champions League group stage. Inside to Armstrong if they can find Olivier in charm. He's in a bit of space and in charm's there and he scores! What a crucial goal that could be for Celtic. Celtic will be for the second year in succession in the group stage of the UEFA Champions League. With Champions League football secured then, Brendan Rodgers decided to add two new players to the team. One was Odson Edward, who signed from PSG on loan, and the other was the return of Patrick Roberts as August came to a close.